From Golf Bravo 90. CQ, CQ, CQ. I can talk to people all over the world. This feature is brought to you by Essex Ham. Hi, this is Pete, M0PSX. And this is Kelly, M6KFA. From the Essex Ham website. Uh, Kelly, whereabouts are we? Well, you've actually taken me today to my first amateur radio rally, and uh, we're in Kempton. We are indeed. This is the West London Radio Rally in Kempton. It happens twice a year, but the big one is in November, and it is a pretty packed venue today, isn't it? There are so many people here, and you can see so many different call signs, people wearing their club T-shirts. It's a really nice atmosphere. We've got Icon, we've got Kenwood, we've got the RSGB bookstall, and uh, you were quite impressed with a few titles, weren't you? Oh, my favourite is the Flying Saucer Technology. I have to say, that's definitely one for my bookshelf. Then, of course, we've got the, uh, the leading retailers of the area. Uh, in Essex, of course, Waters and Stanton are uh, one of the, uh, the biggest suppliers around here. They've got a very busy stand over there, and I can just see Steve over there filling out some paperwork. Uh, we've also got the guys from uh, Practical Wireless and Radio User. They're here as well, as well as Martin Lynch, one of the other big suppliers. But a lot of these people are just either from local clubs or enthusiasts that have just set up a pitch. There's such a broad range of things here. There's things from unused toroidal transformers. Uh, Which I know you're very keen on. Of course. But literally then down to horseshoes. You can get anything here. Literally anything. I must admit, there aren't many uh, young ladies around, are there? I think you're pretty unique. You're getting some funny looks as well, not only there in your uh, Essex Ham t-shirt, but also um, one of the fewer females in the, uh, in the room. Would that be fair? Yeah, and definitely one of the fewer people in their 20s. What would you say was the scene? Just give us a quick description of what we're looking at here. But it's just so busy. There's a lot of people happily having a chat, catching up with different people from other clubs, getting some food and a coffee. It's, it's a good social atmosphere at the moment. We found um, Edmund M0MNG. Hello there, Essex Ham. Are you enjoying yourselves? <laughs> uh, we're having a lot of fun, aren't we? Having a wander around. There's all sorts of components and other weird bits and bobs uh, here to look at. Uh, so what are you doing here? What are you looking for today? Well, I never come to these things with a shopping list because invariably I would be disappointed. So it's a case of coming to see what there is and grabbing any bargains. So far, I've managed to spend hardly any money at all. So what do you look for at a rally? Are you, are you looking for the bargains or the social side of things? Well, mainly I look for people who operate websites and who walk around with a microphone. <laughs> but uh, there is a very strong social element of it. In fact, uh, I was walking along minding my own business around there and a lady behind one of the stalls saw the T-shirt that I'm wearing, which has my call sign and name on it. And that's a, a tip. If ever you come to something like this, always wear something that will identify you because you'll recognise some people probably, but equally other people who might have worked you on the air will recognise your call sign, even if you wouldn't know that they were who they were just by looking at them. So I was nabbed by one of the stall holders who turned out to be involved with the, uh, the Farnham repeater group that I'm actually a member of, but I'd never met her before. So she saw the t-shirt and said hello. So social element mainly, but also to see what I can spend my pennies on as well. Awesome. Well, Edmund, have a nice time, and uh, you will, of course, be on the website. Thank you very much, and I'm glad to see that uh, Amateur Radio is doing really well in, in Essex, and I'm really pleased to see that you're encouraging new licensees particularly to get on the repeaters. Excellent. Have fun. Enjoy the show. Thanks very much. 73s. 88. I think it's definitely good to come here and, and to meet some other people. When you meet other people that are doing it and you don't think it's just yourself on your own setting up your aerial, because it is a unique hobby in the, in the sense that you don't find that a lot of younger people are doing it. When you kind of have that in common with other people and they can give you some advice and you get that sense of a community feel and a proper club spirit, then, then it's definitely worthwhile coming to. Excellent, well said. And of course, you don't have to travel to Kempton because every February on Canvey Island, there's the Canvey Rally. Kelly, can I convince you? Oh, I think you're going to drag me wherever rather than convince me. It looks like they've got a uh, coffee shop over there. What do you reckon? Oh, let's go. This feature was brought to you by Essex Ham. For more information, please go to www.essexham.co.uk.